Pastor Ben Lim here from D.C. at the Trump Hotel. And listen, the Lord spoke to me yesterday that in the next 32 hours up to November 1st, the enemy is trying to release warfare, witchcraft, havoc, confusion, destruction. We already know that this is his dark, evil, demonic nature. But don't fear because I believe that there is a way out and the blood of Jesus keeps us protected and covered. In the next few days, I saw in the spirit that there are going to be storms of darkness where the enemy was trying to release confusion. We destroy accidents. We destroy any death sentences, any premature death cases over your life where the enemy was trying to cause you to be distracted, discouraged, disappointed, get into accidents, get into crashes, where just evil, unusual things were going to take place. However, God is releasing unusual breakthrough. God is releasing his heavy hand of righteousness over your life. So even in the next few days, up to November 1st, the Lord said, pray, be vigilant, stay rooted and grounded, be alert. Jesus himself said, watch and pray. So in the next few days, up to November 1st, I believe we need to be vigilant, we need to be sober-minded, we need to be woke, we need to be in prayer, we need to press through. You may be in a storm right now, but you're about to pass through, and you're about to make it in Jesus' name. Remember, uh, October 31st, although the enemy says it's Halloween, and there's a lot of nonsense and seances taking place, but originally, November, uh, October 31st, is known as Reformation Day. It is the very day where Martin Luther, one man, one reformer, Martin Luther, stood up against the evils of the Catholic Church of the day, nailed the 95 Thesis upon the doors of the Catholic Church. 95 Thesis, 95 reasons as to why they are wrong, they are an error. And one man, Martin Luther, nailed the 95 Thesis, and that began the Reformation, which in a sense also began the renaissance of Europe, a new beginning, a rebirthing, come on somebody, which also delivered Europe from the medieval ages and the dark ages, okay? So it's not about Halloween, but it's about reformation. It's about transfiguration. So in the next few days, although there may be a warfare, and although there may be some darkness where the enemy is trying to conjure up witchcraft and seances and hexes and vexes, but from now to November 1st, God is breaking through with a new form, a reformation, and he is transfiguring you in his glory. So be on guard, be on fire. Uh, we release the hosts of heaven in Jesus' name. The angels of God are to and fro. We destroy any accidents, anything that's not of God. You're protected. Be alert and walk with Jesus even in the next few days as we enter into November 1st. God bless you.